It has been a while since we last spoke. I think it's been a month and I apologize. I got a new job and that's not an excuse, but I've just been super busy trying to figure out a new schedule around my job. It's only part-time, so that's good, but it's just been tricky balancing YouTube, Instagram, a new job, and also having a minute to breathe and enjoy my life. <laughs> if you follow me on Instagram, you'll kind of know what's going on because I've definitely shared more stuff on there. And if you don't, or if you're new, hello. I got a new part-time job here in Berlin as a content creator for a underwear, period underwear brand called Ouya. It's a startup, so it's a fairly new company. They've only been around for around four years now, and they only have about 37 employees. So it's fairly small, but also very cool because I get to work very closely with the founders. And I think that's super, super cool, especially as a content creator and just getting insights into the business is pretty cool. My previous jobs have all been online only. And although it's been really nice because I've been super flexible and I've been able to work from wherever I want, it's kind of nice now that I am in Berlin that I'm also able to feel more involved or indulged in the culture and the city because I work here and I'm meeting more people. And it is really nice to be able to go into an office and have an office space as well for work and not always work from home because that can get a little much. Whoever works from home will know what I mean. It is nice to get away sometimes and have a space dedicated for work that isn't your home. So we do have a couple of office spaces and I wanna show you one of them, the one I'm working in basically. I usually go in about two times a week, sometimes three, depends really on my schedule and what I've got going on. I hope you're going to enjoy this little office tour and let's get on with it. So as you come in, on the left we have the toilet. It's really not that exciting. I mean, I can show you, but it's literally just a toilet. So I don't even know why I'm showing you. I guess it's got some cute like weird decor. So that's nice. Then as you come in, we have the COVID tests over here. Uh, and this is kind of just like a storage unit, but like the main area is here. So we have some of the underwear on display here, along with the packaging, which is really, really nice. I think the packaging is absolutely beautiful, actually. These are all like hand painted, different flowers and leaves. I think it's so, so nice. And then in here is kind of like the first office space. Like it's empty because everyone is pretty much gone home. I'm the last one here, but as you can see, there's some like displays of more underwear on like rings and then just a bunch of desks and just stuff, you know, office stuff. And then here is an overview kind of of the main office area. So we have a little uh, couch area going on over there. And then this is kind of a table with, I mean, this like interesting, uh, thing going on there. Uh, but yes, just like some cute chairs. I mean, it's literally just a basic office space, but it's really pretty though. And behind these drapes is basically where my heaven is going to be. It's going to be a props wall. So these are some of the props for tomorrow's shoot. But behind here is basically going to be a massive props cupboard. So it already kind of is, but uh, I'm going to basically organize it how I want. And then on to the kitchen area. So here is the kitchen. We've got this really cool retro looking fridge, which is stocked up with Oatly. We absolutely love that. <laughs> so basically what's provided is Oatly for all of our coffees because we're coffee addicts. And then they also provide us with some dates, which is super random, but these dates are basically here. You can eat them throughout the day if you want. Buy one of my favorite brands, you guys, Koho. I don't know if you've seen my Instagram stories. I show that I order peanut butter from Koho. They do like big, not wholesale. Well, I guess wholesale in a way, but like big amounts of things. And then this is just other people's stuff in there, so. And I don't think we have anything in the freezer. Let's see. Wow, okay, we have some <laughs> ice creams for the shoot tomorrow. I have absolutely no idea how they're going to carry these an hour away without it melting. That is gonna be absolutely interesting to see. So this is the kitchen. It is an absolute vibe. I absolutely love everything about it. And again, there's some dried fruit for us to eat whenever we want and some nuts and of course coffee because wow. 
kind of need coffee in life, don't we? They literally have the best coffee machine. As you guys saw, I had a coffee earlier. Amazing. And then a selection of teas as well, which is really, really nice. And they also have a soda stream machine. So if you want sparkling water, of course, I mean, we're in Germany. If there wasn't a soda stream, I would be concerned. But yes, they also have this option. Of course, there's a microwave if you want to bring, you know, food from home and heat it up. But yeah, it's just a small, cute little kitchen. Such a nice aesthetic. I really want to do this like in my house one day. That is just a vibe for me. And I love the dry flowers they have. They have some really pretty dry flowers going on in this office. Like there's this pink selection up here. There's also this one here. I also really love this. Like how pretty is this? It's so simple, but it's like stunning. And then we have this dry flower selection, which is very pretty as well. I love a good orange combination. So this here is another meeting room, but it's basically gonna be turned into my studio. I'm going to basically have the opportunity to use this room. Sorry for the focus, I don't know what's going on. But yeah, I'm, what is happening? Is there a ghost? <laughs> Hello? So I'm going to have the opportunity to basically turn this into a studio space. I've made a mood board for it. So I'm gonna insert that for you guys, show you what kind of vibe I'm kind of going for. But for now, all there is is just a table, some chairs, a whiteboard, like kind of like a small meeting room. And they have these rugs on the wall, which I think is a very interesting design choice. We already have some of the backdrop drops over here we've got like a nice pink and then I think like a beigey eggnoggy vibe so these are kind of the main colors of the brand as well as of course some others depending on the season and the seasonal changes here's like a nice blue green pastel colors but yeah that's pretty much gonna be my little space so I'm really excited for that to kind of be done and ready for use and let me show you the last office space so as you come in back to the main area this is the last office space here is actually where I work most of the time so again it's exactly the same to the other one I showed you at first. This one still has the blinds up because I'm working in here. But again, just shelves to put your stuff. A nice printer, love a printer because I definitely don't own one. Here is my ring light. It's a really bad one, but it'll do for now. <laughs> it's tiny and we were really struggling with it earlier, but it's all good. They also have given me this gimbal. It's a very small one and it's actually only just for iPhones. So I'm gonna see how to use this and what I can do with it. Here's basically where I've set up my little Oh my gosh, look what I'm eating. These are vegans, muffins, so good. Along with a coffee because the coffee machine, as I told you, is absolute bomb. But yeah, I'm just working a little bit. And oh, again, they have the designs of the packaging on the back wall here, which I think is so pretty. I love that. And I actually look so crazy right now. I don't know what it is. It's been a long day. It's been a long day. I would be happy to tell you guys a little bit more about what I do exactly. I mean, I'm basically a content creator for a period underwear brand called Ouya here based in Berlin. I'm only working part-time for them. So I'm actually in charge of creating all the reels that you would see on their Instagram or most of them because they still have some old stuff going up that I didn't do. I think you'd notice my style maybe if you follow me. And also I create ad content for them. So basically any sponsored ads that you would see from that company. So that's pretty much what I do. Uh, I've only been working here two weeks. I don't know when you're watching this video, but as of today, it's two weeks and I'm really enjoying it. I'm loving it. And I'm also really happy that it is part-time because it really works well for me. I'm also able to focus on my own social media channels and pages and my own content as well as also have some free time and also get to work for this cool company. So all in all, so far, I'm really enjoying it. If you want to know more details about how I got the job or what a typical day looks like for me, I'm happy to also make a video like this. I think actually tomorrow I will film kind of a day at work with me because we are having a full shoot day. So I'm going to be on set pretty much the whole day getting content. So I think I'll try and like vlog some stuff. We're actually going to an Airbnb that's like an hour from here, over an hour. It's really pretty, it's really cool, but um, it's just far. But yeah, I'll try and get some content from there. Sadly, it's gonna be raining because we have a really cool swimming pool that they wanna use for the shoot, but uh, it's gonna be raining cats and dogs. So I don't know how that's gonna work. Yeah, anyway, I can definitely chat to you guys a little bit more about just my job, how I got it, what I do basically. So stay tuned for a video like this. Just to close my eyes If you're gonna make it soon Maybe we could get our room But I need to rest